Law enforcement in our area has been scrambling to stop the sale of a new synthetic drug sold as bath salts. And today they got some big help. Alabama Attorney General Luther Strange announced an emergency rule, meaning that possession and distribution of bath salts are now illegal. Oxton News reporter John Rogers has details. Investigators say these little one-ounce bags of white powder pack a lethal punch. They're sold as bath salts, but they're synthetic drugs, and now they're illegal in Alabama. Given that other states are seeing now major problems with these drugs, and Alabama is just beginning to see those problems, we wanted to get ahead of the curve. Florida's Attorney General recently banned the synthetic drugs, and the Mississippi House passed a bill banning it as well. Alabama health officials say there are chemicals used in the creation of these fake bath salts that are considered by the DEA as controlled substances. Users of these drugs have been treated for extreme paranoia, hallucinations, and hypertension. That's the other thing that apparently is, is uh, pretty intense with this is the craving that the drug creates and so that there's this desire just to continually re-stimulate. Mobile police and Pritchard police have already taken an aggressive stance on stopping this synthetic drug. The emergency ruling will only last for 120 days. Officials say this will give lawmakers time to formally declare the drug illegal. In Mobile, John Rogers, Fox 10 News. Alabama is the fifth state to declare bath salts as a controlled substance. It now joins the ranks of Florida, Louisiana, Mississippi, and North Dakota.